production of personal protective equipment and other essentials to contain the spread of the coronavirus pandemic. Professor Luke Anike made the disclosure at the launch of the institution's production of hand sanitizers at its campus in Agnani. TVC News from Delhi Ajayi has the story. In some climes, the value of higher education is measured by the quality of impact the immediate environment of the individual will derive from the person. These contributions trickle down to form a pool of resources for national development. Our university didn't want to be the last on the line, as is always the case. So we decided to uh, ask the unit of our university, Biotechnology Research Center, which we have reactivated, and uh, took up this challenge. These scholars say their input is to educate the public on the dangers inherent in productions of personal protective equipment and other healthcare material which isn't driven by research findings. Metanol is carcinogenic. We think so it is advised. We do not use metanol to produce hand sanitizers. What we're using in this one is ethanol and also prepare alcohol and blend of the two. And we insist that the percentage alcohol must be up to 75%. Elsewhere, the Director General of the Nigerian Inland Waterways, Dr. George Mogalu, through his foundation, distributes physical stimulus packages to people in the 179 communities in Anambra State as part of measures to cushion the effect of the partial lockdown imposed on the state. These are very difficult times and uh, people are very hard off as we talk. So people are trying to assuage people, giving them food items and all that to be able to participate in the stay-at-home directive by the state and federal government. Some of these people are the people that the what, they, what they get in a day that they eat for that day. And they have to, to ask them to stay at home for one month to try and visit something. So what, they have, what, what I've tried to do now is to help, to, it's, a, it's a palliative, just to try to help people overcome the, stress, the economic stress of uh, the COVID-19 problem. The whole local government chairman is here. They will take their own their own share to their various local government. From there, they now go to the world because the world is going to receive, the local government is going to receive, so that the grassroots people will also receive these items. As nations grapple to contain the spread of the deadly disease in their territories, public and private individuals and organizations are encouraged to cooperate with government in the effort to win the war against the pandemic. Max Stevenson News at now.